professional ethics. This video and the reading notes will be short this week, as you have your capstone project due. But let's take a brief look at professional codes of ethics before the semester is over. They are meant to guide the practices, attitudes, goals, and conduct of practitioners in a given field. One of the most famous is the Hippocratic Oath. The link to the Wikipedia page is on the assignments page. Another famous code of ethics is the International Code of Medical Ethics from 1949, also one of the readings for this week. As we know from popular movie fiction, great power demands great responsibility. While this quote is from Voltaire, it is Jesus who originally taught the idea in Luke 12, 48. Everyone to whom much is given, of him will much be required. And of him to whom men commit much, they will demand the more. So, how do we ethically wield our power? Codes of ethics help guide us. They are created by committees of professionals who practice the arts that they know. In our field of educational technology and instructional design, we look to AECT, the Association for Educational Communications and Technology. The history of AECT goes back to 1923. The National Educational Association created a department to address visual educational techniques, lantern slides, and the silent movie picture being the impetuses for the creation of the department. The department eventually broke away and became its own organization known as AECT. Enjoy the reading this week, as short as it is, and have fun completing your capstone project!